Hey everyone, and welcome to another video where we're going to put in some new private plates, some special nice 3D ones I got from Number Plate Clinic. Just to replace the front and back, going to look a lot nicer, especially from the side with the red coming through on it. Very happy for that. Um, we have got a deal for them, so it's 10% off if you just follow the link to our website down the bottom with the discount code SPODGE10 that's down there as well in the description. So yeah, you just follow that if you want them. But yeah, let's get started getting these on. Okay, so first off we're going to go on with the rear plate, very much similar to the debadging if you saw that video. So hopefully this should come off easy enough, Might fingers crossed. Yeah. Okay, so after struggling with that we've kind of got some pry tools to try and lift it up and off without ruining the paint. <laughs> yep, that's always the key, don't ruin the paintwork. Nah. There we go. Starting to get the... Sweet. Right, what Do you think my car needs are clean? Honestly, you're disgusting. <laughs> you're disgusting human being. Okay, and now onto the front, which should be a little bit easier, considering it's just... These bolts are just going to shred up. <laughs> should, <laughs> as fingers, fingers crossed. It turns out it's also stuck, stuck. underneath those two bolts. That I mean, well, it's got mould growing. Like, you've got mould. It's fine. We'll get rid of that, it'd be weight reduction. Even that didn't have mould. <laughs> <laughs> That's like 90 years old. Yeah, oh, you're just, oh, disgusting. That is, that is disgusting. <laughs> oh my god. You're trash. <laughs> <laughs> you saw the car before that you is it, didn't you? That is beautiful. You didn't buy Look at that. Unseen, did you? <laughs> <laughs> Bloody hell. <laughs> Yeah. Lovely. Absolutely lovely. Lovely. Oh. So, what I'm thinking is we're going to now need to get the car a good clean so we're not just sticking new plates over the top of that. So, let's get that done now. Okay, and we're back and it is looking, yeah, a million times better now. There's nothing growing on the front, uh, around at the back. We haven't quite got the sticky bits off from the old one, but... Yeah, it's a lot cleaner than it was at least, so... There's no yeah, there's no mould or anything growing on the car, so it's a lot better than it was. So yeah, now we should go to the new plates out, let's get started on them. Okay, so obviously in a perfect world you would get these completely removed from the old one, but we are, as usual, short on time and impatient and all the good stuff like that, so... We're just going to go straight on it and work around them. They are thicker. So, yeah. obviously if you're, the pads that you're using are thinner than the ones you've already got on there, that ain't gonna work, so. Yeah, well they should be thicker anyway because half of these ones are on the back of the old plate. Yeah. <laughs> now you put it on about like that, slightly you, but That would annoy you more than it would me, I think. <laughs> no, to be fair, you'd be all right with it. Now you need to help me line up. Like that? Yeah. Looking good? Yeah, higher or lower? Maybe a bit higher. But not too high, so we can't can't see the shit at the bottom. <laughs> That's gonna have to be there. Yeah, uh, that'd do. Yeah, central. Uh, yeah, that looks good to me. Okay, yeah, so I am hugely happy with that. Looking absolutely brilliant. But yeah, don't forget, we got the link to the website with a discount code in the description. So if you want to get 10% off if you're ordering them, because they do look fucking spectacular. Uh, but yeah, the only thing I will say, if you're getting private plates and films to the car, don't forget that you obviously have to go onto the DBLA, actually change them over, at least in the UK you do, to register them to your car. Make sure that you do that 
in between basically when you're fitting it because you don't want to do it before you change plates because then you can't drive your car if anything happens and you need to make sure you do it as soon as your plates are fitted because you can't drive it after they're fitted until it's registered but yeah after that little bit just say goodbye and we'll see you in the next one peace Car needs to clean that. Oh, <laughs> you gonna be, you're not gonna fly backwards on us there. <laughs> so good till Matt goes back and smashes his head in. If that happens when I die, you can't have the MX5.